Uh, driving missions. Aren't they the funnest, guys? Don't you just love, love driving all over the city? So much fun. We're probably pretty long. How far are we? Let's see here. Oh. Uh, well, we're not too far. Could be further. It'd be quicker if we had a better car, but uh, I guess this one's okay. Uh, it'd be better if we had some straighter streets. I think that would be the most optimal optimal thing for us here. Hello, police officer. Can I change? Oh, fuck me. I was trying to change the, the uh, radio station to see if they would stop singing or if they'd start singing something different. I fuck myself over there. Yeah. Trying to figure out how to drift in this. I'm guessing B is drift. Ooh. Well, yeah, after this, I better get me some, some money. I better get some money for this. It was a lot of work. Driving all the way across the city, two drunks and a dead body. Having to deal with their smell, their throw up, and their stupidity. This is your life, Vito. You should start thinking about it. Is this what you want to do for the rest of your life? Deal with Joe Oh, fuck me! Oh, fuck me, man. I guess I was going too fast. Some idiot just drove into us. Hey, 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 hey. You stopped your car. It was your own damn fault that I drove into you. Now, I may have been going over the speed limit, but that's no reason to uh, be an asshole. Fucking hey, man. I might have to just pay these guys off, because this car does not drive that fast. Oh, maybe not. Sorry, Vito. Not exactly the best way to end the night, huh? But thanks. I owe you one, big time. Leave Eddie's car here so he can get home in the morning. You're a good man, Vito. I'll settle up with you tomorrow. Hey, you coming in for some drinks? You're fucking kidding me, right? Three in the morning. Shut the hell up! Hey, <laughs> shut up, you whore! Come That's on. not very nice. We'll you had enough, girls. Eddie. You're going to bed. To you. Come on. <laughs> I'll call you tomorrow, Vito. Good night. Usually, after throwing up, that kind of takes away the intoxication. But he's still pretty fucked up. So. Chapter 8. That was literally the entire chapter. The Wild Ones. It was me just going and burying a dead body. What a great chapter. Uh, what the fuck? Hey, Vito, rise and shine. Jesus. What the fuck? Marty, stop fucking yelling, will you? It's killing me. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, Joey. Stop calling me fucking Joey. What the hell's wrong with you? Vito, come He's on. a moron. Jesus Christ. Stupid kid. Alright. Meet Joe outside. Well, it looks like we're going to have a uh, very shitty day of working. Uh, driving around a truck. I think this is the one where we sell cigarettes. So, I guess I don't really need to take my suit out. Although, I don't really know what else we have here. Casual suit and raincoat. No. No. I need to get something that's uh, a little more casual than a suit. I mean, it says casual suit, but it's not very casual. It's more fancy than anything, so... I guess I'll just go with the leather jacket for today. So we can get some more money and get some more clothes. Kind of sucks, though. I mean, I got, like, all that money, and then they threw me in jail as soon as I got that shit. It was, like, two or three thousand dollars. And then I walked outside, and BAM! Jail time. Okay, dick bags. Alright. I'm here, Joe. What are we doing? What the hell was that? guy's got a voice like Woody fucking Woodpecker. That was Marty. Remember Marty. Remember the kid you slipped down the street from me? I had to pick up the truck here, so he gave me a lift. What's going on with the truck? It's gonna make us some nice cash. Hop in. I'll explain on the way. You drive. Where to? Riverside. Yeah, of course I'm driving. Riverside. I'm always driving. 
I'm starting to believe that Joe doesn't oh, actually know how to drive. Yeah, you could say that. And he's kind of ashamed Why? of it. You ain't still mad, are you? Nah. Very in a stiff. That's the first thing I wanted to do when I got out. Hey, come on. Get yeah, the fuck out of happened. the way! Yeah, yeah, I did. I got a shit ton of cigarettes out. back here. But, uh, everything between then and now, not so much. All right, all right. Well, listen, today's gonna be a lot better, I promise. I sure as hell hope so. I could make a stop at the shop here and, uh, get me... Did I even get any money? I don't think I did. I kind of want to go see if I can get me an outfit here. I mean, this is all kind of fancy stuff, though. Hey, Even the, pal, like, shirts mind? or button-ups. What the hell? What did you just say to me, bitch? Alright, uh, sorry. I didn't mean to buy it. L if let me register. Let me, let me know. Uh, yes. Yeah, oh, wait a second. Here we go. That looks like the same thing I have, though. Uh, yeah, current clothing. Okay. Well, fuck. I was hoping to find something a little more casual. I mean, I could just get me a shirt there, but... We're doing dirty work today. I guess this outfit does work. I just wanted something different. Because we've... We've had this before. I like to change things up a bit, but I guess it doesn't really matter. In the long so run, it's not that important. Sure. And I lost my door. Look places and unload these smokes. Then we bring the truck back to Eddie and get our cut of the tape. Piece of cake. Wait. Yeah, where's Eddie and all this? I seem to remember getting a fucking asshole for a piece of cake just like this. Seriously. Don't worry. I've done this before. First stop Riverside. If you say so. Trust me, you're going to thank me later. Yeah, if anybody's going down this time, Joe, it's going to be you. I mean, I I served the last sentence, so it's your turn. turn red? Joe. The cops don't give a fuck about red lights. They only care about you hitting people and going over the speed limit. So I can run as many red lights as I want to, and there will not be a single copper that comes after me. I also went the wrong way. Is this going to re... Uh, nope. It's going to keep telling me to go that way. Alright. Fuck it. Turn it around. Bim, 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 bim. Uh, that thing fucking sucks at turning. Most of the cars in this game are pretty terrible at. God damn it, I'm trying not to hit vehicles, but there's so many goddamn vehicles in the way, and I can't get this thing straight. Can't get it lined out. Whee! Is this the same hill I've been up like six times? No, I don't think it is. I think it's a different one. Ba, 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 ba. Go faster. Yeah. We're hitting 40 miles an hour. Woo. 50. 60. Oh, oh shit. I was... <laughs> Seriously? You gotta be fucking kidding me. I was paying too much attention to the speedometer, and I hit the side. It was kind of jutting out in my defense there, so... Ah. <sighs> I have to start the entire chapter over. That's great. Well. Let's just... As much as I hate driving missions in this game, let's just get it over with. Let's not fuck around. I'm also going to skip this. Jesus. Yeah, I'm not a big fan of driving missions. They're just... They're tedious and boring. And, yeah. Tedious and boring. About sums it up. Not a big fan of the drive missions. But, uh, what are you gonna do about it? We still got a ways to go in this game. I think there's like 22 chapters or something. We're only on chapter 8. It's a pretty lengthy game. That? That guy's got a voice like Woody fucking Woodpecker. That was Marty. Remember the little kid used to live down the street from me? I had to pick up the truck here, so he gave me a lift. What's going on with the truck? It's gonna make us some nice cash. Hop in. I'll explain on the way. You drive. Ew! 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 Nasty old twin ladies. The only difference is that they, one has a red purse and one has a black purse. Yeah, they don't have it, as many character oh, models as you would hope yeah, in this game, unfortunately. Wow. You do see twins there, quite often. Nah, very in a stiff. That's the first thing I wanted to do when I got out. Hey, come on. 
You had fun at the cat house, right? No. Yeah, I did. No, I didn't. Thank you Fucking A, cop. But, uh, everything between well, at least now, he's not after me. He knew, he knew that was his own right, damn fault. He right. turned. Well, listen, today's going to be a lot better, I promise. I then again, I was on the wrong side of the road for a second there. But he turned into me. It was his own damn fault. And he knew that. He knew that. Hey, cop. See, Joe? I just ran that red light. That cop did not give two shits. So you can shut up about the red lights. All right? Now, the speed thing, that's a completely different story. I can understand that. I mean, I, I ended up killing myself last time. Oh, fuck me. I ended up killing myself last time, so. So what's the deal? Simple. We just gotta go to a couple of places. Apparently very fragile. Smokes. Then we bring the truck back to Eddie and get our cutter to take. Piece of cake. Wait a minute. Uh, fucking A, man. This thing does not turn. Just like this. Don't worry. I've done this before. First stop, Riverside. If you say so. Trust me. You're gonna thank me later. Hopefully these places aren't, like, completely halfway across the map from each other. And just completely out of the way of each other. Otherwise, I'm going to be very upset. Let's see if we can get some good music going on here. Or is it all shit now? Now that I've uh, been in the pen. Yeah. Yeah. I can't really even hear it. I have it turned down, so. Oh. 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 This is my road, bitch. Get out of the way. Fucking A, man. The turning. It's terrible. Hey, it's not my fault. You gave me the shitty car that can't drive for crap. Well, at least we're here. Who do you love? Oh, yeah, yeah. Who do you love? You drive like my fuck. What now? Now we take care of our customers. These guys here buy in bulk from us. Come with me. Okay, climb up and hand me the goods. Why am I doing all the bitch work? Hi, one carton of reds. Carton of reds. Hand me a carton of reds, Vito. Uh, red carton. There you go. Yeah, that's the one. Is that really bulk? I mean, it's a cart, not for all, but still, that's not really bulk. I would consider bulk at least, you know, like two boxes. Hey, good to see you. I'm all that's bulk. Give me a cotton of blues. This is literally what I'm cart doing. Cart of blues coming up. Cart of blues. Uh, can I get the cart of blues? Uh, Vito, can you? Hear yeah, I'm trying, Joe. Blues? This is a very difficult right. task. Hand it over. I don't think you understand the uh, the difficulty level here. Here. Let me guess. Carton of whites? No, I guess that's it. A few hours later. We haven't literally been standing there for... I guess we have. We've literally been here for an, for hours. There are like 10 guys, maybe, and we've been here for hours. What the fuck? Oh, hey, we got $328. Hey, Sarge, how you doing? Carton of blues, as usual? Carton of blues! Uh, I think I'll take the whites this the time. The whites, ah, racist motherfucker here. Get that veto. Let's go. Caught no whites. I, I should just give him the wrong Bingo. thing. I wonder what would happen. You motherfuckers, trying to jit me, trying to get me a carton of reds when I ask for a carton of whites. Thanks, Joe. Now get the hell out of here, will you? Okay, time to go. Get in, Vito. Next stop is Millville. I got two dollars for that. Wow. We're making some serious dough. That's pretty crazy. Yeah, I know, man. Two dollars? Two dollars, yeah! We got two dollars, Joe. That means we sold, uh, like, what, 160-something cartons? It's fucking ridiculous. That is a lot of cartons. Doesn't look like our inventory's gone down at all, though. Yeah, that's pretty cheap, though. A whole carton of cigarettes for two dollars. I mean, a pack of cigarettes alone is like six dollars now, so that's fucking ridiculous. I don't know how much a carton is. But price, price elevation. So it's crazy. Works for Eddie too. 
<laughs> in his dreams. Then again, it was a depression back then. I think this is taking place during that time. Around, makes deliveries, that sort well, probably not anymore at this point. He's a gangster, though. Spends too much damn time with the movies. Well, if the kid's got you for a role model, he's in for a lot of trouble. Oh, yeah, wise guy? He reminds me a lot of you when you was his age. Exactly. And I spent two years dodging bullets in Europe and six years in the camp. Six time. years. That's uh. What's the matter? Somebody shit in your coffee this morning? It's like you forgot about all the good times. Yeah. Remind me of those. Little Italy. 